are an awful lot of glaciers here at Wrangell St. Elias. So we're going to take a look at these glaciers and see what's going on from a bird's eye view. All right, let's go.
large moraine. This is on the side of a glacier. And this is some of that material that gets carved out by the ice. And if you look way down in the distance, you can see the glacier that we're going to be going on. We're going to actually walk out on a glacier today and see what that's like. And those little dots out on the water, out on the ice, those are people out there. So you get an idea of the scale. And again, over here, you can see that's all basically where the glacier is in the middle. And then on the sides, right here in front of us, all that gravel, that's all moraine mixed in with other bits of ice and water. So let's go walk out on a glacier. So we're coming along, going up toward that glacier. And remember, this is called a moraine. This is all that material that's carved out. But sometimes when a glacier is moving along, it carries really big rocks. And when it melts and starts to go back, those rocks that are in the ice, they just drop right down and they're on the ground. And that's what we call an erratic. That huge rock just sitting there. Somebody didn't carry it out in a truck. The glacier brought it down and dropped it off right there. Pretty wild stuff. All right, ready to let's go, go out and walk on a glacier. But before we do, you've got to have something that's going to bite into that ice. You need some good stability when you're walking. So we put these crampons on, and they help hold your feet in place as you're walking through the ice. These kind of big teeth. So let's get out there and see what's on, out on the glacier ice. I know. The radar. We're now on top of the glacier, and we're starting to explore this piece of ice. But keep in mind, as we're walking across the glacier, the glacier itself is still moving. Just a few inches here, a few inches there, but slowly but surely it's carving this whole valley out. What an amazing landscape this is. places that you could possibly find on the earth. This is called a Milan. This is a drop right down maybe into the heart of this glacier, hundreds and hundreds of feet down inside this glacier, down inside of blue ice. What an amazing place this is, this moving piece of ice and snow. Amazing. <laughs> Thank you. 